Hi, welcome to video number 12 in the Maximo Application Suite Maximo Manage Technical Snippet Series brought to you by Starboard Consulting. In this video number 12, we're going to continue with our role as an administrator and look at setting up our users in Maximo Manage similar to the way that they were created in prior releases. So from our earlier video, we created our user in the Maximo Application Suite now within manage we have to make sure that user has access to particular features functions applications so let's continue with our user that we had been looking at earlier i'm going to grab my bookmarks here and this is granger who we looked at in the application suite and we said that he was an authorized user so again i can see him over here in maximo in the user application everything is perfect here is the groups that I had granted access to for Granger. So everything here is the same as it was in prior releases. We again just are setting up that extra step, having that user defined in the Maximo application suite so we can define his license type and enable him for other mass uh, products. So here he is, our groups. Well, let's just go back home a minute. Let's go to the security groups and I'm gonna bring up that technician app that Granger is a member of. Let me highlight or hide or condense that action menu there. So here's our technician group that he was a member of, Site Bedford, everything here is still the same. Let's take a look at our applications here because this is always slightly different and, and this has been changing with the additions of the work centers. So let's just take a look at apps and let's see, hey, does Granger and the technician group have access to quick reporting? So as you scroll down here, here's my quick reporting application in Maximo. You can see that the navigation or the look and feel is a little different. I do want to make sure that he can save a work order. He's got read access and he can go ahead and um, basically I could select all those individually. Which is, which is nice if you like to click that button, or I can just say I want to give him all access, which is tremendously easier. And I'm gonna go ahead and save that. So now what I've done, just like I've done in earlier releases in Maximo, I've granted the technician security group access to an application in Maximo. But what about those work centers and tools and tasks? Well, let me take a look. I've changed my application type to work um, and let me change that to work over here so again what i've done is i want to look at my work execution application type i should make this clearer that it's a work center that would be easier let me try that again center see if i can spell it right here we go so our technician has access to the work execution work center perfect um, but now there's another type of work centers, the tools and tasks. Let's take a look at that, but now let's grab those inspections. I want to make sure that he can go ahead and conduct an inspection. And yes, the technician security group has access to that. So again, once your user is set up in the mass admin, the way that he's defined and has access to features, applications, work centers, whatever they might be in Maximo or Manage is still the same. So thank you for your continued time as we explore security and access in the Maximo Manage application suite.